Hi everybody, my name is Josh May with Remax of Grand Rapids and of course, welcome to Living in Grand Rapids. <music> Excited to feature Ada, Michigan, one of my favorite places in the world. But before we get started, I definitely want you to hit that like button, hit the subscribe button. If you love the content, we'd love to hear some comments after the video. So let's get into it. So right now we are standing in the older village of Ada and we're going to talk about the new village of Ada in a little bit because there's been a resurgence in this area and I'm really excited to chat about this. But let's get to some history. So Ada was actually founded in 1821. Now this is a small village that is about 11 miles east of downtown Grand Rapids. It's a quaint village as you can see. You've got some amazing restaurants. You've got an old school hardware store, some cool bike shops, shopping. One of my favorite is Nona's right behind us. I've got stories of me, you know, taking my kids here for breakfast before school. It's just a really, really quaint, cool place to check out. The other cool thing about this area is it's really walking distance to a lot of the local schools and we're going to get into some parks. Next, we're going to cruise over to the Ada Covered Bridge, which is a very historical place. Give you a sense of a little bit more of how Ada was founded and what this community has to offer. So let's go check it out. So just a short walk south of town, you'll come across the, the historical Ada Covered Bridge. Now this is a historical landmark in West Michigan. It was built in 1867 and it's amazing. At different times of the year, you'll see people taking all their wedding photos here. It's definitely one of the most photographed places in West Michigan. But it's a passageway over the Thornapple River, which is uh, heads north and south through Ada and then out to the Grand River. Um, it's a really great place to just kind of walk and hang out. Um, you've got, you know, beers on the bridge, which is an exciting event during the summer. And, you know, I want to get into parks and recreation while we're here because that's one of the best parts. That's why people move to Ada is things like the Ada Pathways. Uh, you know, we call it Ada Connect, which there's, um, you know, right now existing, you know, over 30 miles of paved uh, bike trails. And again, that's why people live here because they want to be, you know, close to their work, but they want to be in an active environment and the setting is absolutely amazing. So moving on to some of the parks that you'll find here, you know, in Ada, you're, we'll talk about Legacy Park here in a minute, which is in downtown Ada. Uh, we're just a short walk from Ada Park. We've got Seedman Park, which is up in the hills here just east of Ada. And then another park that we'll uh, connect on is Roselle Park, which is on Grand River Avenue. So lots of parks and recreation here. Just really a beautiful, beautiful recreational place to be. So just want to take a minute to get out of the rain, as you can see, have a seat here and chat with you about Ada Real Estate and some schools in the area. So let's just talk about real estate. Obviously, this is my specialty. Um, so the village of Ada, you know, you'll see a lot of historical homes there. But there has been a movement at um, you know, finding some vacant lots, building some new construction. So in the village itself, you'll see a lot of new condos, a lot of new townhouses that kind of border the river there. Um, you'll see some great new construction. It's a highly, highly desirable area now because everybody knows that the business district is, here, is now here. So it never used to really be here. The small village, as we were speaking about, was never really conducive to everybody moving out here so that's where the new construction comes into play now as far as Ada Township as a whole you know you'll see an average medium price range of about 565,000 spread out away from the village um, you know you'll see larger lot sizes a little bit more of a country setting so it's really an incredible incredibly beautiful place to live as mentioned the Thornapple River runs north and south you've got a lot of riverfront properties here highly, highly desirable real estate. And then uh, we'll move over to schools next. I wanna connect on schools and we're gonna do a completely separate segment on schools in the Forest Hills District, which Ada sits right in the middle of the Forest Hills Public School District. Now there are plenty of private schools in the area and there are plenty of elementary schools and also private schools really within walking distance of the village of Ada. 
In fact, my children go to Ida Vista, uh, the Spanish Immersion Program, which again is just a short walk away from the village. So um, Forest Hills is a very large geographical area as far as a school goes. And like I said, Ada sits right in the center. So we'll connect much more on schools in the area at a later date, but just wanted to take a seat, get out of the rain, chat a little real estate and some schools, which again, you know, are my specialty. So as you can see, we've certainly got a different look from the older village feel of historical Ada into the new village, which has taken shape since 2015. Now this is called Envisioning Ada, which has been a movement to bring tons of new businesses shopping and I'd say probably quadruple in size uh, the actual village of Ada. So we've got some of my favorite places right behind me. We've got Zayton Turkish Restaurant. Um, you've got the Ada Market, which was always something that was missing here, it was a large grocery store for people to come. And what's really cool, you'll see the sign behind me. This is all a new social district. So you can come out from shop to shop. You can go from store to store, grab a drink, grab a glass of wine, and really stroll the streets and enjoy. And uh, it's an amazing place to come. It's an amazing place to see. But I would be remiss if I didn't mention that we are right next to the Amway headquarters, which is right across the street. And Amway has been such a big part of this community. Uh, that is the flagship headquarters you know, that have been here for 40 years, 50 years, and um, Ada and Amway, you know, have gone hand in hand over the decades. But, you know, you, you enjoy the, the old village of Ada, you know, take a stroll through the historic bridge, uh, enjoy some of the music on the lawn, uh, bri bri beers on the bridge, um, Legacy Park, as I had mentioned, is right around the corner from me here. And you can stroll the paved walk path, you can listen to the music on the lawn, and you'll be walking right up the Thorn Apple River. So it's a really beautiful place to be. And you can spend all day here, you can spend days here. And the last thing I will note is, there is also plenty of housing here. So they've got um, 92 upscale apartments coming, they've got a boutique um, hotel coming, and uh, tons of office and retail space here. So you've got to come out and check out the village of Ada. It's a special place and we'd love for you to enjoy it. So thanks for listening. Again, if you guys have any questions or thoughts on what you've seen here, certainly put those in the comments below. We'd love it if you'd like and subscribe and have a great day. We'll see you in another week. Bye-bye.